Hi guys, it's Cheyenne with your Daily Dose for Sunday. This week is Pumpkin Week! Oh, I'm so excited because pumpkins are great. I don't care what you say. Pumpkin spice everything is the way to celebrate fall. So, on that note, I am going to be making a pumpkin spice cheesecake with my brother. So, without uh, any further ado, let's get baking! Finely crushed ginger snaps. Some finely chopped pecans, about one-fourth cup. A fourth cup butter or margarine. Melted. Four eight-ounce packages of cream cheese. One cup sugar. One fifteen-ounce can of pumpkin, one tablespoon of pumpkin pie spice, one teaspoon of vanilla extract, and four eggs. So the first thing we have to do is heat our oven to 325. Got it. Alright, so you're gonna mix your crumbs, your nuts, and your butter. and you'll just mix it all up together. So once you have that all mixed up nice together, you're going to put it in a 9 inch round loose bottomed pan. And after it's in the pan, you're going to smoosh it around so it covers the bottom and then 1 inch up on the side because this is your crust. Okay. I think that looks fine, yeah? Yeah. yeah. Makes like a decent crust. Okay, so that's about what your pressed crust will look like. And now it's time to make the actual cheesecake part. Okay, so for this part you have to have a nice large bowl, your cup of sugar, and your four things of <laughs> cream cheese. <laughs> that's fine. <laughs> you're going to put the sugar and the cream cheese in together, and then you're going to blend it with a mixer until it's uh, blended together. <laughs> So as you can see, this is uh, this is our cream cheese and the sugar is on there and it's a lot so make sure to use a big bowl and it's probably a good idea like we did to break up the cream cheese so that your mixer can actually um, do something. So Jacob's going to go ahead and start mixing. This part was making me so nervous. I know right, it's going to fly everywhere. Okay, so once that's mixed together, then you're going to add the vanilla, your pumpkin spice, tablespoon of it, and finally, your pumpkin. So much pumpkin. <laughs> okay, and once you have your vanilla, your pumpkin spice, and your pumpkin, you are going to mix that all together. I thought to eat this. <laughs> yeah. Am I going to die? Is it delicious? Does it have much flavor to it? <laughs> I'm worried. <laughs> like. <laughs> so once your cheese cakiness is mixed good together, you're going to add each of your four eggs one at a time, and then you're going to blend slowly until it's mixed, and then add another egg. And yeah, that's beautiful, Jay. Thank you. Come on, Mr. Egg. Okay, so now that all of our eggs <laughs> have been blended in, um, and everything is blended and it's all nice and smooth, we finally get to put it back into our pan where we have our crust. Pour it, Jakey. This is beautiful. You're such a great help. <laughs> right, once it's all poured in, you just smoosh it around so it has a nice Evenish top. Beautiful, Jake. Beautiful. 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 So now, your cheesecake is ready. Your oven is ready. It's time to put it in the oven. For how long, Shannon? For, is it an hour and 20? An hour and 20 to an hour and 30. For an hour and 20 to an hour and 30 minutes. Okay, about to pull it out. <laughs> Wait, that's a cheesecake? <laughs> Oops. <laughs> that looks 
like some kind of pie. <laughs> it's a cheese pie. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna let it cool for a good while, and then we might drizzle some caramel on top. And then we're going to put it in the fridge for six hours? Four to six hours. Four to six hours. And then you can eat it. Okay, guys. Well, that was me and my brother making pumpkin spice cheesecake. Hopefully it sounds good to you and hopefully it tastes good and hopefully you guys try it. And if you do, don't forget to let me know on any of my social media I have in the description. Um, don't forget to like, comment, share, and most of all, subscribe. I will see you next week. Bye.